Well, it's great to be in South Philly, isn't it? So here, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to say a few brief words, and I, I thank you all so much for being here. Uh, I'm going to introduce some folks who have been affected by Kamala Harris's disastrous policies, because I think it's important to put a human face on the disaster that has been Kamala Harris and to remind the American people this is why we need President Donald J. Trump, because normal people benefit when he's the President of the United States. But first, let me say just a few words, and then we'll take some questions from reporters. But let me, let me just start out by saying that Kamala Harris has been such a disaster as vice president of this country that everywhere she goes, chaos and uncertainty follow. We have got a war in Europe. We have got a war in the Middle East that threatens to spiral out of control. We've got chaos in the world financial markets. Everything that Kamala Harris touches has been a disaster, and we have got to kick her out of the United States government, not give her a promotion. Now, now, today in particular, I've already met with some people who have really suffered because of Kamala Harris's border policies. And let's just count the ways in which our border czar opened the American southern border. On day one, Kamala Harris suspended deportations. On day one, Kamala Harris stopped the Remain in Mexico policy that kept our country safe. On day one, border czar Kamala Harris, she stopped construction of the southern border wall. And on day one, she proposed amnesty for millions of illegal aliens in this country. And we know that every time Kamala Harris took an action to open the American southern border, it is families like many of those who stand behind me today who have suffered the most. And, and now, for the past two weeks, Kamala Harris has been saying that she wants a promotion. I think we ought to say to Kamala Harris, you're fired and rehire Donald J. Trump as President of the United States. <laughs> 